Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev. Welcome back to this let's play of XCOM UFO Defense. Or UFO Enemy Unknown, whatever you want to call it. But we just discovered that there are indeed more aliens around the, on the map, and that's not what I was ready to do, ready to play around with. That is kind of unfortunate. So we are gonna have to hunt uh, that last alien down. And I don't know where they can be hiding. Um, and worse still, we might have troops at risk due to this. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. If you actually saw him, no, that's fine. That's okay. Okay, so the, he's not inside the UFO. We're fairly certain of that. I don't need any of you guys because I don't really want to risk you. I just want to see if I can find that alien sucker. Uh, by hovering a bit around the map. If nothing else, that alien should shoot at us once they see us. Mm, I guess I'll blast through this wall. Maybe it's simply one of those mind control fellas that I just missed. Could be. Uh, but just in case. And you, you know what, let's have a look inside here. Yeah, I know there's no line of fire, I don't care. Make a line of fire. Uh, oh right, that's a two wall thing. Um, dang it. Move around, turn around, and then shoot. So we can actually shoot at that square. And open a gate. Anybody home? So, no, it doesn't look like it. Okay, this is sound solid. Oh, there he is. Okay, there he is. So we know where he is over here. Now I just need to find him and kill him. There he is. I think you, you must have been one someone we la lost track of earlier. Oh, I didn't mind control in one go. Boo! Oh my! Brainiac, are you? Well, it could be he has, he has increased defenses because he just panicked. I don't know. Okay, he is a new dude. Someone we haven't played with before. You do not need this gun. Throw it away. Unable to throw here. Yeah, that's fine. Just there. And then please just hover towards the completely harmless tank. And that was the last one. Okay. Now we can finish this. Good thing this guy didn't move around and tormented my <laughs> the few uh, soldiers I had out on the map. And that is certainly the last one. Good, finally. And we recovered that simply because it was within Chi the Chinese territory, right? Yeah. So, was there anything else out and about? Not really. We knew that we know about the base in on the Antarctic. That's fine. Oh, it's in a little dashy island thing too. <laughs> cool. Not gonna do anything with that. Let's see. Since it's been so long since I played, what the heck was I doing? I know I was researching a couple of things, like the alien grenades there. We transferred a ton of corpses and stuffs to Claymore. Trying to transfer the rest of the soldiers 
or uh, scientists. So we're going to do that. Manufacturing, I think we started constructing a firestorm. Yeah, we did. Uh, we have adequate funds. We are building up more defenses and side labs. And I was thinking of tearing down some of the labs and stuff here. Once we have... Um, once we have... Uh, oh, brain freeze. Um, <laughs> yeah, once we have transferred the scientists. That's what I was getting at, yeah. Would be fun to make our bases essentially immune. Um, I wanted to see if we lost Illyrium, was it? There was something about plasmas I was supposed to remember. And I already uh, but I've already forgotten. <laughs> um No matter. Okay, we're gonna definitely sell stack some stuff. Need to. Uh, we have 18 of these things in the ships already. As long as we hunt down aliens, I don't think we're gonna risk running out of clips. Let's see now, we have, uh, yeah, we have 18 aboard the craft. Keep another 20 stockpile, that's fine. We don't need this many stone bombs, got it down to 10. Grenades down to 1. Don't need all the corpses. Actually, we transferred all the corpses, we don't need any of them, I think, but... Sell that at least. Make a little bit of money. Okay. Ethereal, and you're heading for Southeast Asia. At an incredible speed. Uh, the Firestorm should be able to intercept that. Let's try. Avengers, Avengers would be good uh, interception craft too, though. Have to consider that. It's just that they they take so long to build, and they're expensive. Got some attack. This is gonna be blown to bits. Yeah, there we go. Blown to bits over China, so they should be happy. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Research completed. The alien grenade. Device works in the same way as the terrestrial grenade, except that it is more powerful. All well and good. Um, no, we're not going to allocate any research. Because we were going to transfer people to Claymore. Uh, at least another... 100. No, not 100. 50. Base information... You have room, right? You have room for all, all 100, but you don't have lab space for all 100. Okay. 50 scientists are going to be transferred to Claymore. Transfer. And the remaining ones are going to start continuing their research. But what? That's the question. Right, we have all these uh, people to interrogate. <sighs> Don't recall what who we've uh, interrogated already. Um, uh, let's go with the soldiers first. That seems fine. Onwards. Did I just see that right? Supply ship. 
Alien base in the Pacific. Are you telling me they already have a base in the Pacific somewhere? Did they establish one earlier? I'm kind of terrified that's exactly what they did. It's still on high speed. Nope, they're about to build something new. That's what they're gonna do. Because there are two of them now. Yeah. Of course, we only have the basic interceptors down there. Uh, the Firestorm has no, uh, no range to get that far. Um... The Avenger just might have range. I'm gonna make a save. As I always do. Just in case. Just in case we do something catastrophically wrong here. Um, we're gonna send Avenger 1 after this UFO. And we're gonna send you after that UFO. If it slows down, we'll be able to intercept. It slows down or changes course. Got okay, last UFO position for now. For that matter, you can target him. Um. That one at least can patrol. Huh. Well, the Pacific is pretty large. But there are only so many places they can actually make a base. Uh oh, okay, um... Select new target. You for 100. Uh, I want you to head out and patrol above. There. I want you to head here. And we'll see what we can intercept. I do not want the Ethereals to be able to build a base, so... There we go. And we took a heavy... quite a bit of damage to the Interceptor there, to have the Avenger. So we'll be unable to salvage any... craft, but I think that's gonna be fair enough. Ah, uh, we're too late. <laughs> Look at that! Ah... Uh. Okay. They established a base right next to us. In that case... Return both interceptors to base. Kind of sucks, especially because it is a um, ethereal base. I don't like that at all. And it is basically within the US. Right? That should. No, maybe not. Let's see. It will count as Pacific. But it should also count as the USA, right? Uh, I don't know. No excessive activity yet. If 
But yeah, that base has to go. Of course, our biggest founder is actually Japan, not the US. And third one is... Well, uh, third one is Australia, which is... <laughs> unusual. I do wonder if this is scrambled every, every, every game. I don't, recall I don't recall Australia being one of the big funders of the project. Still, they're paying way more than, say, India. I think it's India that's at the bottom. Yep. So, there we go. They set up a base there. Sure, now, let's see. Um, select your target, you'll actually be able to intercept that. Hopefully, if you have enough fuel. And that could actually be an earlier base. I think they didn't they do that again earlier. Dang it. Okay. Not able then. Um ah, never mind. It'll just have to be lost. We can't intercept it. And the other interceptor would be able to get here in time, so yeah, okay. Uh, still refueling. Yeah, you're not gonna be able to be of any use. You're being repaired. The Firestorm couldn't get there in time. It wouldn't have the range and you would... Nah, that wouldn't work either. That interceptor from here in China probably wouldn't get there in time. So we'll just accept that one's gonna be lost. Didn't lose our base, did we? No. Okay, that UFO is still here, and you're not ready. Okay, maybe we can get one. One of them. Yeah, maybe they're building a second base. In the Pacific. Come on. Come on! Oh! Ouch! Ouch! Okay, that hurt. That hurt. My pride more than anything. Um, interceptor 4. Very unlikely you can get that, that one in time, but hell. Let's try. So, we lost another craft. Okay, we'll have to build up more firestorms. <laughs> Probably some adventures too. Yeah, but that kind of sucked. That probably impacted our score rather badly. Yeah, losing interceptors, that's not really... What I don't know if is this actually keeps the uh, damage. Yeah, it does keep the damage. So that is that is the really sad thing. We only needed one more, one more push, we, then we would have been able to actually down that UFO. I don't know if you'll be able to intercept this one in time because it's heading for the Arctic, which basically means it's gonna swoop up, swoop up into space. Yeah, we won't be able to get that in time. It's gonna go away pretty darn soon and if it doesn't let's send the firestorm let's well at least have the range for it now might even have the speed please kill it kill it with plasma fire and you should be able to do aggressive attacks you can at least take some damage there we go Yeah, we definitely need to build more interceptors if we're gonna get the air war. Ooh. And both of them are in for repairs. 
Infiltration. It shouldn't be an attack craft, but I want to be safe. And I can't intercept it because we're repairing on both the craft that are somewhat capable of attacking it. Which means if it lands, we can't actually intercept it either. How far along are you, by the way? On repairs and stuffs. 14% damage. Yeah, you're gonna be staying in repairs for a long time. 4% you might be done repairing before this one disappears, but... It's only a Firestorm. I don't think the Firestorm can actually handle a full battleship. And if it lands, we can't actually do anything. Since uh, our intercept craft is in for repairs. Wait, rearming? Oh yeah, that's the interceptor. That's not gonna cut it. Firestorm could possibly dawn it, but uh, most likely... Oh, dang it. They landed. They came to London, by the looks of things. Yep, they landed in London. And we're not doing anything, and that's... Uh. Now I wish I'd kept the old uh, Sky Ranger, because at least we could have landed there and dealt with it. Uh, yeah, this is the problem with sending out the Avenger for retaliatory strikes. Need to stop doing that. And can I force it to go outside, even though it... I want you to go there. No, nope, not allowed. Has to be ready. Which means there is nothing we can do. Grumble. The Martian solution. Okay. Our research now points to Mars as the base of the alien operations. The base is well hidden and contains all the manufacturing and cloning facilities to fuel the infiltration of the Earth. It also seems to contain a controlling computer of some kind that controls the whole operation. It seems that the high-like alien society has some kind of queen bee. This is uh, their fundamental weakness. If we can eliminate the brain, then the body will die. We must step up our research efforts before it is too late. In order to progress, we must capture the highest ranking aliens, the commanders, which only reside in the alien bases. Which we've already done. So. By researching that the alien commander next, we'll be able to learn about that. But of course, we have so many other fun things to re research. Uh, let's get on with the corpses. But we did finish manufacturing things. Let's see, that was a grav shield. Good. Uh, this base can now tear down some bits and pieces. It doesn't need such much living space or lab space. Um, let's... Yeah, there is actually a bit of a problem tearing down this particular square. Uh, I don't quite recall. There are some... I, I remember reading about that. There's something very peculiar about this particular square. In that it can become walled off in missions and stuff. So I probably want to avoid that one. And I can't tear down structures that'll leave the base uh, impossible to navigate. Yeah, I can tear down this and that and we'll still have a connection like that. Or I can tear down this. And that would probably be safer. But yeah, dismantle this. And dismantle that. Yeah, that's okay. And then we build facilities. Fusion ball defenses. Didn't even look at the price. Plasma defenses. And that means it's gonna have all the defensive types. And the grab shield. Which means all of them will fire twice. And that's going to be enough to destroy just about anything they send at us as far as I... As at least I remember that being the case. 
Of course, I could build just build uh, multiple fusion defenses instead. That would be even more effective, but... Yeah. I, pr I like the variety. And you're just gonna build things down this way, so that's fine. And you are not gonna build another interceptor base, that's true. You're getting both of those, that's true. Uh, do you have 20 soldiers? Did I hire staff here? I didn't do that. So let's see, I have 20 soldiers here, right? Or oh, 50, 50, I mean. And 20 on this base. Yeah. And none on Claymore. But I don't have the equipment either. So... Defenseless soldiers. Not a good idea that either, but... I will see what we do. I'll just have to sit here and watch the aliens infest London, and sadly, nothing we can do about it. But what I can do is take a break, and that's what I'm going to do. So, thank you for watching.